We got Joey here today launching his Hotliner. He says it does over 90 miles per hour. So we'll see uh, just how fast that is. I haven't seen that live myself before. So. Okay, throttle lock on. Throttle lock off. Okay. It's got a gear gear reduction in it. Okay, cross the runway. Turn it on as soon as it leaves your hand. Okay. Three, two, one, please. You want me to count? No. Alright. You see, we have to be synchronized or else I don't turn on the prop at the right time. Alright. <laughs> okay, I'm going this direction. Make sure we're clear of the quad. Yep, and 30 degrees up. Launching! 3, 2, 1. Whoa, straight up. <laughs> clear the runway. Things really high up there. Sorry, you guys, I don't have any zoom. Oh, it's coming in. That little thing's booking it and pretty quietly, too. Oh, well, no motor on right now. Oh, so it's just gliding. Yeah. Motor only goes on for a few seconds. It's that inefficient? Uh, right. It's that high power. Oh. It will, what, it'll burn out something if it stays on too long? Basically. Oh. Did not know that. Can do that for what, three seconds? Five. Five seconds. You can't put a bigger ECS or motor or you just can't take it? It could. I don't have the money. And that's oh. where the style of hot wires. They're not really designed to, to go full out. For longer. Uh, yep. It's just designed to get it up in the air quickly so you can glide at a fairly high pace. Basically. But because you uh, spent so long flying, it's actually got wonderful flight time. Inverted and out. I probably went way too far that way. That's too bad. And a little back up there. Really? That little bugger's quick. I've never turned on the prop for anything except straight up before. I don't even know what it would do if I turned it on in horizontal play. Uh, you might need to either try the whole length of the field or have a bigger field. <laughs> It would burn out well, the motor? No, well, no, it wouldn't. The, uh, so long as I kept the low five seconds. Do anything fly five? Yeah. yeah, and besides, the faster the plane goes, the less amperage the motor actually takes, so the less chance of burning it out. Yeah, that's point, yeah. Come on, you're a double E, you should know that. <laughs> double E? Electrical engineer. Oh. Are you clear? You gonna try flat flight, or? Probably not. You don't no, really have I'm enough not really getting more comfortable in this. This is my third hotliner, but it's actually only recent time flying. I only just got in the air. Oh. And the fastest plane I have is an old old red, and I think that's probably going to top out about 40, 50 miles an hour. I have one jet that's a little faster than this. So I can only fly that when no one cares about noise. Which obviously you can't really do here. I enjoy fast planes, so over time everything I've had has gotten a uh, power upgrade of one caliber or another. Whoa! Was that intentional? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Alright. So we'll end this video about five minutes. It's
So that was uh, Joey, right? Yep. That's Joey with his hotliner, and there it goes. All right. Doing Losi, Metal Fox 1911. Viewers subscribe. Take care, y'all. Bye.